Good morning, beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's gonna be my morning. intro. <laughs> <laughs> Will Daniel know? Yeah, he'll know, but it's, it's okay. Shout out to Daniel. Shout out to Daniel. Um, right now we are headed to church. Church. And then after we are going to go to our registry, which I'm super excited about. Yeah. And I'm going to record Darius doing it because he's a pro at registering for baby stuff. Because he has so many kids. I'm just kidding. <laughs> because he used to work at Babies R Us and he he gives me a really hard time because I call it Toys R Us. It's a big difference. Like they're the same company, but you gotta get it right, you know. So after this we're gonna head to Babies R Us with my parents and um, we will see you guys there. Darius will give you tips on to what what? Tips, tips for and tips. tips and trucks for uh, <laughs> registering for a baby shower. So we will see you guys then. Bye. All right, so before we go in, Darius is gonna give you his five basic tips um, when doing your registry for your baby shower. Take it away. All right, and these are uh, kind of off the dome, so I didn't have much time to research this, but um, I'll say rule number one is do not register for like clothes. Um, it's okay to register for like onesies and like packs of socks and stuff like that. But if you register for clothes, most likely they change during the season. Those clothes go on clearance and it's impossible to find clearance stuff once you register for it. So don't register for clothes. Like if you see a shirt you really like, either buy that shirt right then and there or don't register for it. That's tip one. Tip two. <sighs> two. Um, tip two is to research a brand. Um, if it has to do with like car seats, strollers, cribs, research the brand you want, not necessarily the design you want. Cause like a lot of people, uh, see a stroller and they're like, oh, that's cute. I really want that stroller, but it could be like a really cheap brand or it could like, uh, be like a model from a year ago. So research, <coughs> the, um, the make and model you're going to get too, because if you pick a stroller or a car seat, we used to have people do that a lot. Um, they come back three months from now, it could be gone and then they don't know what to get because that thing is gone and it's on clearance now. So just kind of research, um, like the strollers and car seats and stuff, you're gonna get the brands and everything like that. What about that one? Spritex, it's the safest car seat you can possibly have. Um, they're tested at uh, like 65 miles an hour compared to car seat, regular car seats are tested at 30 miles an hour. So it's really nice. How do you detach it? I think you just go like that. This one might be locked. Oh, there you go. And then this is cool too. Oh, you have to unlock it. <laughs> Wow. So if you're like by yourself, you're like, Ugh. you have the baby in your hand, you can just pull it up like that. You know what we should do? <laughs> this is super cool. Let's do that one. This one's expensive, $439. Maybe someone loves us enough. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't love us enough for you. <laughs> so hopefully someone loves us more than we do. Yeah, I was saying, because I Number three is to um, buy stuff in bundle. Or pick stuff in bundle like instead of just getting a bunch of individual bottles see if you can find like a big pack of bottles or instead of just register for a car seat a stroller try to get like a travel system a travel system is a car seat stroller and the base in it um that goes for anything like if you want like receiving blankets don't just buy one or blankets or or diapers or stuff like those are not going to be individual diapers but just get quantify it make it more of a bundle instead of getting individual well, rachel recommended getting one of the smaller uh high chairs which is a good idea to get one of those, but these ones, like I said, the bundle, it'll come with the uh, the bigger high chair and then it'll transition into the smaller seats. Like here, this is the perfect picture to show it right here. How this one goes from one, from full size, the booster seat, to taller chair. All three in one. Number four is uh, p try to pick everything the same brand. Uh, if you get like a certain type of bottle you're gonna go with or a certain type of breast pump or a certain type of thing, try to get everything with that brand because some of them do say universal, but it always works better with the brand that it's intended for. So number four is to uh, try to stick with one brand and go for it. Even if you do go for a different brand, that's fine if it's universal, but if you can, always pick the same brand. <laughs> Medela is the brand to go to for breast pumps. Why? They're the best breast pumps. The best you tried them out? <laughs> tried them out. They're the best. <laughs> Number five is pick with what you're going to need, not what you want. Um, because you see a lot of stuff that you like. For instance, um, they have like bassinets and stuff like that that people buy buy all the time. They return them because they never use them. Uh, buy stuff that you're really going to need, not stuff that looks cute or looks like fashionable or stuff like that. Buy stuff. Pick the essentials first. 
because if someone goes on your registry, they're not going to know what you actually need. They're just going to pick like some random stuff and they could be pick the same as how you were like, oh, that looks cute. I want to get that. So pick stuff that you actually need. And then the stuff that you like think that's cute and that you want, you buy that for yourself. But in your registry, pick stuff that you actually need. And that's number five. Dr. Brown, not Dr. Brown, because um, bottle company too. Oh, there's also a van right here. Yeah, a bunch of bottles. Yeah. I say the best bottles supposed to go with their glass. Glass would be better than plastic. Oh heck no, I'm drop them. I know, but the glass is better to have than plastic. So which one do you recommend going for? Um, I like a vent, but um, I want to see what type of bottles, the glass bottles they have. Okay, so we just got home from our registry and it was so much fun. I think Darius did such a good job and I'm so excited for all the things that we got. I, like honestly, I really love our registry. So I hope those tips helped. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll see you guys in our next video. Bye!